Welcome to Tiafa Garage. On today's episode, we're gonna continue with our Porsche Flare weld on project. Let's try it and find out. Tiafo Garage. I've removed the paint from the inside as well as the outside. Here we have our Dicom layout fluid. I'm getting the final placement of the flares here and looking at every dimension for consistency across the two sides. We've got the flares all set up so that there's a even height on either side from our level on the other side. And the fore aft is determined by centering the hole inside the spring access there. Next, we're gonna drill a couple of holes uh, to stitch it in uh, and the, with the eighth inch holes and then this is called a Clico. It goes in the hole and then it you squeeze this thing and it expands and then pinches the two metals together. We have got our Clicos in, now ready to do a scribe line. I completed the rough cut all around, so now we'll use the scissors to just take off this little strip. In my completely non-professional opinion, I'm gonna call this close enough. We still have a Clico there, so we'll be cutting off that tab seam here. That looks like a big gap, but it's just because it's so, uh, you know, not flush. It's late in the day, but I do want to just try to get one weld on, so I'm going to just try and find out. I'm encountering the curse of uh, TIG welding, so, you know, it's such a small gap, but even so, I'm having a hard time getting it to create a pool. Tune in next time to find out whether or not I recover from these disastrous TIG weld seams. We'll see you next time on Tiafo Garage. Tiafo Garage.